I was originally approached to do this project by Casey Nicolau, who is the director, and it's a personal favorite of mine. I had seen the original production in 1981 when it opened in New York, and it was such a powerful evening of theater and so gloriously beautiful that it's just something that has stuck with me for, what, 30 years now. So it's an honor to be a part of it here in London. In many ways, my task on this is to reinvent the Dreamgirls aura for a new audience, for a new generation. It's a very challenging evening for the actors, and they have many, many costumes. The Dreamgirls themselves change 16 times. You have to know how to plan getting in and out of things without exhausting everybody so they have their energy to go and deliver these amazing musical numbers written by Henry Krieger. So once I know how a dress has to function, then I can go into how to make it a beautiful object. We estimated on this dress that there are probably 30,000 crystals on a single dress. In the story of Dream Girls, they start off as young kids, and we see the journey of them becoming celebrity pop artists. The song is Dream Girls. It's the first time where we see them performing in a lavish venue. The dress is very important because it's where they, they've arrived. Mm -hmm. 